welcome to the mr wilson show ladies and gentlemen uh, your mom is a ho i mean you don't know man the 80s was a f***ed up time i mean your mom uh, might have probably you know snorted cocaine or uh, a guy might have you know snorted cocaine off her bum you never really know you never really know i'm saying that there is a probability a possibility that your mom has snorted coke okay and today we're talking about this this, this these fucking weird ass people called like the anti dream uh, uh, stands and stuff okay they will go out of their fucking way you know to tell you oh my god dream stands are cringe it's to the point where i don't even see any dream stand i just see these people and it's to be honest it's kind of it's kind of cringe like think about it think about it i know i know this this is like a fucking 200 iq take ladies and gentlemen look at this fucking driving the truck get in the back of my truck why you don't like uh, stands is because what they do is all they talk about is dream you know now think about it like this you fucking penis with a haircut you know you're doing the same thing you're going on fucking different people's channel just saying uh, you know uh, i don't like dream stands dream stand dreams so you're you're, uh, you're like in a way you're also fucking sta- uh, standing uh, for dream yeah it's just think about it it's it's a fucking 1 million dollar iq uh, 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 thing okay i know it's it's oh fuck man fuck i almost hit my truck I I I actually did. I actually did. And uh, not almost but you know. You guys know what I'm talking about. Okay, get in the back of the truck. Okay? Um so yeah. Ah fuck. What was I talking about? I lost my fucking train of thought. See? See? Your mom probably has snorted cocaine, but I actually snorted cocaine. um yeah 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 so let me tell you guys a little story about what happened uh, to lil ol pop okay i made this video uh, uh, a while back on uh, you know like i reacted to the geo square video like he made against dream about the cheating allegation and stuff and i was like you know uh, the math doesn't add up and stuff okay it's uh, i i explained my logic and stuff and all i got in the chat oh you're just a dream stan you're just a dream stan you just and did did you guys i don't think i don't think most of y'all uh, know what he means when he saying you know like a dream stan or something yeah i feel like he's talking about a super fan and i think uh, yes he did he did kind of make a video about this as well yeah but uh, there are a lot of creators out there you know saying that uh, i don't really like the idea of there being stands of me and you know that's something uh, that one has to acknowledge you know okay you don't like it but dream you know he doesn't he doesn't care he, i mean he if he likes it there being like a uh, like a stand of him or something. like those accounts that have their uh, their uh, you know uh, wh- what you call it their uh, profile pictures as as dreams profile picture or something you know on twitter yeah like uh, twitter uh, people really fucking care about twitter right yeah so but he doesn't care about it so it's like you know that's that's out of the picture that he's not upset with it okay but then there's one more thing you know I've seen a lot of takes going around there you know saying what are you doing with your life if you're uh, if you're if you have dreams picture and if you're standing someone motherfucker these kids are fucking 15 to 16 year olds okay when i was fucking 16 you know shit was you know it was it's like you know you you, you, you I mean you were fucking horny all the time or something you know it's like a fucking breeze blows and your penis gets erect you know it's 16 year old it's not it's not i mean it's not like you know like these fucking 16 year olds except for being uh, like a dream stand putting their profile picture as dream 
uh, uh, you know, you know, they're gonna fucking, you know, uh, uh, become like the president of the United States or something, you know, like that's that's what they what they got in their life, you know, that's what they're gonna do. And don't act like all fucking morally superior or something like you've never stand for anyone in this regard, you know. You 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 you've totally did, you've totally did. I mean, I've did, yeah. I've, I, I've done it uh, like uh, fucking multiple times and stuff, you know, I jerk off once and then I put my uh, hand on my dick again, you know, and it's like the rise of the planet of the apes, okay, I keep watching porn so it rises again and then I jerk off again, you know, that's what it's all about, that's what it's all about ladies and gentlemen, and uh, you know, it's, it's, it's so fucking cringy, you know, I, I, if, if I would equate the things, you know, to, uh, if I can equate it to a situation, I would equate it to this, okay? Uh, it's kind of like, you know, uh, how, how snowflakes do it, okay? You guys know who snowflakes are, right? Uh, uh, I know, you know, it's, it's like a political term and, uh, and stuff, okay? A snowflake is a person, you know, who gets, uh, uh, you know, you would give them like an argument or something and what they would say uh, at the end is uh, oh you're just racist you know it's like it's like these buzzwords racist uh, misogyny I, mean, I know i know this not equal uh, to you know some calling someone a stand or something but i'm just giving the fucking analogy okay so shut your fucking mouth okay yeah you get what i'm saying you get what i'm saying see this, 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 this See, these are the fucking high-level IQ takes that one should talk about, okay? Not your fucking low IQ. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. Stan culture has always been there. When, and, and I'm pretty sure we're not talking about, you know, like the people that are fucking crazy. And I don't think there are any 14 to 15-year-olds uh, who are, uh, who are like, you know, putting their pregnant uh, wife in the back of a truck and driving uh, b uh, over a bridge and dying you know that is where the where the whole uh, what you call it the the, the stand thing came from right it was from uh, from an m and m video or something yeah so uh, just chill out you know you know if you're if you ever get uh, uh, get like you know i need to be passionate about something you know i need to say something to someone you know just fucking rub your nipples or something it helps. It fucking helps. Okay. It fucking helps. See, right now I'm 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 getting angry. Look at this. Look at this. This is fucking angry face. <laughs> See? And I rub my nipple. And I'm happy again. Yeah. So that's it. That's something that I want to say. Uh, but yeah. Subscribe to this channel. Okay. And uh, I still don't have a catchphrase. But I do know one thing though, bitches they come they go, so, nah, uh, the, the, you, you're a part of a cult now, okay? Yes, ladies and gentlemen, you sitting over there, you know, watching this video, you're my mom, okay? And I'm your father. So subscribe, like the video, okay, and rub your nipples. Uh, take care.